The Pioneer Scholarship recipients are Robbie Nickens, Nelson Warua, Bradley Bonjui, and Alet Wally. They're finally university students. NASFAN Chief Executive Officer Ian Taruti has said the scholarship scheme is the first of its kind initiated to us as students. You know, this is what the country needs. The country needs to, to develop its uh, uh, human capital, its uh, human resources skill base. The scholarship package covers tuition, boarding and lodging fees, administration, book allowance and travel efforts. Recipients will have to meet scholarship terms and conditions to guide them to maintain high level in academic performance. The successful applicants were proud to be awarded the scholarships and this is what they had to say. It's really, I'm really happy with the NES fund. Uh, I come from a place back in the village where you know, parents are struggling to pay my fees just to complete my studies. It's a blessing for me, I can personally say that uh, God has its own timing. But, and I am honored and privileged for this organization to be able to choose me as one of the pioneers. Parent Francisca Waire received the scholarship on behalf of her son, Bradley Bonjui, as he had to resume studies this week at the University of Technology. Um, I, I would say, I think the parents, maybe if they see these kind of things in the paper, they should encourage their children to apply. In meeting the country's economical demands, Mr. Tarote says NASFAN will continue to support education, developing human resources of Papua New Guinea. Fabian Hakalitz, National MTV News.